Hey everybody, welcome back to an episode on Mighty Mall Shop Creations. Today, I'll be showing you my updated progress on my 1969 Camaro Z28 RS by Ravel. Without further ado, let's roll the intro. Alright, so before I get started, I just want to tell you guys that this is technically the first video on this because uh, I filmed an, un an unboxing on this kit uh, and then I lost the footage. So this is technically the first video. So I'll just get started. So we got... What should I start off with? So basically I've just spray painted everything. Right here we have the underbody. Nice metallic gray. For this car, I decided to go with green, so I did a dark green interior with Tamiya British Green. I think that did really well. And along with that, the interior seats, which are bright green, which I don't know how they're going to look, but should look pretty okay. Um, yep. Seats. Here's the dashboard. Again, I did a green. Rear seats. Middle console. We'll go in there like that. And the steering wheel, I did light green as well. And then we just got all the other pieces. So we got, like, not as metallic, but still a little bit metallic. It's more dark, I guess. Um, front suspension and rear, rear suspension. We got black pieces, battery, wheel pieces, engine pieces. Then we got other pieces. There's one grill. This kit actually comes with two, two grills. I'm just getting the other one right now. I'm not sure which one I'm going to go with yet. Maybe count, can you guys comment down below which one I should use? The one with the headlights or without the headlights? And then I've painted these exhausts and the manifolds different colors. As you can see, there's a big difference in shine and color. So these uh, for the engine bit are chrome and then this is aluminum they're both by rustoleum but you can see one is more dull than the other this is more dull this is more shiny i did the other pieces to that in chrome and then i also did the engine which i haven't assembled it yet but you'll probably see it in my next video did it the red Here's the main color. So I painted it, <clears throat> painted the firewall green. This TS20 metallic green. And here's the body. So actually, let's start with, let's start with the hood. So right here we got the hood. Oh no, is there hair in it? Oh no, that's a bummer. I'll have to sand that out. But super nice metallic green. I haven't clear coated it yet, but I definitely will. And here are some other body pieces, like the rear bumper, I believe. The spoiler, or like the little fin that goes on the back of the car. And the front splitter. Finally, we have... There's dust on it. We have the green car, and I think this will look really slick with the black interior. As you can see, it kind of fits through there. Or not the black interior, the dark green interior and the light seats, the light green seats. Let's see if I can put it in there just to show you guys. That's about how it will fit in. Don't know if you can see that or not, but let's see if I can hold it up better. It'll look like that, so it doesn't look too bad. It looks a bit yellowy, but I think off camera it looks better. 
because you know how cameras do that sometimes they manipulate the colors um since i haven't shown you or since i lost the footage the unboxing i'm going to show you guys the decals and here they are they got white stripes and black stripes and a whole bunch of sponsors the uh, license plates Z28 on it referring to the engine I believe and I, I don't know which one I'm gonna use because I want to go with the, the the white but I don't know I think the black gives it more of a distinguished look so that's just a little quick update so far I mean I again I lost the recording of the unboxing so that's why you might not see most pieces here but so far I've only assembled the engine and it was pretty easy um, I definitely recommend this kit it's pretty easy so far um, thank you guys so much for watching the video don't forget to like and subscribe turn on the post notifications so you don't miss an upload from me because I will be doing more updates on this I'll see you guys in the next one Goodbye.